Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. This episode is about Jessup's SHR100. So this film is uh, about uh, 14, 15 years expired. Uh, it's from a chain store in the UK. Uh, I'm sure Jessops didn't, didn't produce their own film. They probably outsourced it for Kodak, Fuji, Akfa, whatever. Uh, I have no idea. I couldn't find information about it. Uh, anyway, it, it aged very well. It's, um, the colors are absolutely fantastic and because we are now starting the autumn and the colors, these beautiful browns and yellows and greens and reds uh, around us, I think they will look really nice on this film. That's why I want to try it uh, and show you guys how some cheap film uh, can be uh, precious uh, for us that like to shoot expired film. Uh, anyway, these are rolls of 12 exposures. I brought two of them. My plan is to shoot only one, but if there are enough um, enough uh, pictures around us to be taken, then I will definitely shoot the two, the two rolls. And as for equipment for this episode, um, I will use uh, the Practica L2. I have never used this camera for an episode of the channel, but anyway, it was my first SLR and I think it's the perfect camera for this episode. Uh, at the moment I have the 50mm 1.8, Pentacon 50mm 1.8, but because I don't have um, a zoom lens, uh, M42 uh, zoom lens, so I brought a lot of lenses with me. Uh, and they are also the 29mm, uh, Pentacon 29mm f2.8. I use it regularly for the other episodes. Uh, also the Post um, 200mm f3.3 and the Tokina 135 millimeters f 2.8. morning and welcome to 7 a.m. in the Hacks. We just woke up about uh, one hour ago. It's the third day we are filming and taking pictures. Uh, we made some nice pictures yesterday and the day before and still we will uh, enjoy a little bit uh, the day today uh, and take some more pictures. Uh, but for now we just really want to share this beautiful sunrise with you. So, I have good news and bad news. The good news is that uh, it's been a really long weekend. Uh, we are shooting for three days now since Friday. And we just finished the rolls. Actually, I brought two rolls of Esop's, uh, Jessup's SHR 100, 12 exposures each, and we just shot them. 
The bad news is that uh, the first roll went okay. We shot it uh, when we were at the hacks and coming down the mountain. But the second roll, I loaded it not correctly into the camera and so when I was pulling the next frame, it did not pull the next frame. So there, there are absolutely no pictures from the, the second roll. Unfortunately, the first roll I shot, I shot it mostly up in the mountain and coming down. And yeah, it's quite a high mountain, about 2000 meters. And there's not many trees up there. Uh, and on the way down, there's many trees, but they are not the kind of trees that uh, get brown leaves um, during the autumn. So there's, I think there's not really many autumn pictures in the first row. The second roll we shot around here in the region of the of the um, Hax mountain, um, but there are no pictures. There should be amazing pictures because the the whole uh, region is getting uh, this greens, yellows, oranges, reds, and we had some really nice, uh, but not. So it's the first time that this happens to me. I hope that. This is a lesson for me and for everyone that shoots film. Be very careful how you load uh, the film into the camera. If it's not uh, pulling the next frame, then there are absolutely no pictures. And we lost, yeah, well, about 36 hours on the second on the second roll. Um, and it's uh, unfortunately uh, lost time. Anyway, I think it's a, it's a good lesson. Uh, I think I'll punish myself for the next two years every day, or at least when I think about it. Um, but yeah, it remains the lesson for me, hopefully for you, that you don't do something as stupid as I did. And let's hope that there's some good pictures on the first roll. So until the next episode.